Warren, who is joined now by the doctors who helped his congregation lose over 250,000 pounds. <laughs> Please welcome co-authors of the Daniel Plan, Dr. Daniel Amen and Dr. Mark Hyman. Welcome. Yeah, now, Pastor Warren, you know, your new book feels so much more than just a health book or a weight loss book. Yeah. It, it's almost like a health movement. What really inspired you to do the Daniel Plan? Well, first place, I had never uh, taken my health for granted, or had taken it for granted my entire life. And uh, one day I was actually baptizing 850 people. And we do it by putting people actually under the water. And about number 500, I had a thought go through my mind. It wasn't a very spiritual thought. It was, <laughs> good night, we're all fat. <laughs> And then I thought, but I'm fat. And, and so we had to start uh, a plan, and I recruited these guys to help me uh, get in shape. And I, I said to the church, anybody want to join me? I figured 200 people, 14,000 signed up. Immediately. Yeah. Yeah. You know, that's part of what this plan is. Dr. Newman, you talk about it, that you need support from other people. You need to, the, 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 we keep talking about willpower. Yeah. Yeah. And that's pretty tough. Yeah. Well, it is tough, and it doesn't work long term. This is a really smart plan. It's based on five pillars: faith. You have to know why you want to be mm -hmm. healthy. That's your motivation. You have to be religious. You don't have to be religious, okay. but for actually, those people, I'm Jewish, that are, and this is works. the Jewish doctor's guide to Christian weight loss. <laughs> <laughs> So it you know starts with faith, faith, then food, fitness. Now, most plans yeah. do that, but ours yeah. is scientifically yeah. sound, really smart. Mm -hmm. And then focus. We add brain health well, in so there. What's the difference? How can I follow your plan instead of a diet plan that says watch what you well, eat? Well, because what we're adding is faith, focus, brain health, How does and, brain health and friends. Work? What is the role of the brain in terms of dieting? Because I wouldn't think that those two would... Well, it's all about decision making. Plus, what most people don't know is as your weight goes up, the actual physical size and function of your brain goes down, which should scare the fat off anyone. <laughs> That's the thing that got me. Yeah. yeah. So, well, that's what he said. He wasn't getting healthy for his heart. Yeah. wasn't getting healthy to be sexier. He's already sexy. But <laughs> when he heard as his weight went up, the size of his brain went down, he got serious. serious. And massive amounts of people lost weight because they didn't want to have a small brain. Yeah. So, Dr. Harmon, you're the metabolic expert, and you did the, the diet plan. You wrote yeah. it out. Tell me a little bit about it. Well, the key is everybody wants to lose weight and get healthy, but nobody succeeds on their own. And the key success ingredient was not just eating the right food, you know, eating food that was grown on a plant, not made in a plant factory <laughs> food. I love that one. But, but it's really doing it together. The secret sauce was how do you change your behavior? And the, what we found is that people who get healthy together do better. Those who went on the Daniel Plan together lost twice as much weight and got twice as healthy as those who did it on their own. Do you own. think the community, though, might also work because of competition? I know that if I was to try to lose it's, weight with... It's the power of positive peer pressure. Right. You know, you're more likely to be overweight if your friend's friend friend is overweight. Right. But you're also... <laughs> the opposite is true. If your friends are not eating, don't say, hey, don't eat that. Yeah. And, you know, hey, what about us? Are you, are, don't you want to get healthy? I'm going to not have a rib and donut breakfast. We're going to have healthy food for our, for our small group study group. We're not mm -hmm. going to eat junk. And that influences people. So what, what is the main thing, if, if, we, if we talk about the Daniel plan, what is it that we should all know and try to follow? Eating so with really other people? Yeah, tell us know again. why you care. Right. Eat whole, high-quality food. Mm -hmm. Move. Get your thoughts right. Don't believe every, every stupid thought. thing you think. Mm -hmm. And right. do That'll it. Make you thin? And, and what we often say is get it. I get need the information. That donut, right? You it's, believe it's, that. Get the information. Then you have to give it away. Because it is in the act of giving it away, you create your own support How do you group give it away? and you keep it together. So 85% of people signed up were women. And when mama got healthy, the children got ah, healthy. So you kind of and pay when forward. mama got healthy, her husband got healthy. And when mama got healthy, it affects the everybody church else. Groups got healthy so, because at Saddleback we had 7,000 groups mm. and people literally got better together. So, mm. Pastor Warren, I know after your son's passing mm. that you said you had a setback with your yeah. weight loss. Yeah. Un you know, it's understandably so. How did you get back on track? And then, how do you tell people? What would you tell them if they have their own setbacks to yeah. get back on this yeah, weight? People, well, when in the they first grieve, place, relapse eat. is always part of recovery. And it's and actually, uh, as two thir 2013 was the worst year of my life, I first had uh, a, a back problem where I was in the hospital and couldn't work out for four months. And then uh, Matthew died, and I, I didn't sleep for six months. Mm -hmm. And then people are bringing me food every day. And, and so I started putting the pounds back on. I lost 65 pounds on the Daniel plan during that six months of grief, gained about 35 back 
lost 30 again. I'm the first guy to prove that it works twice. <laughs> Thank you so much. What an inspiring story. Please go pick up the book. Our thanks to Pastor Warren, Dr. Amen, and Dr. Hyman. Members of our audience are going home with a copy of the Daniel Plan. We'll be right back. Go buy the book. Up next, Cameron Matheson's telling you about his holidays with Jenny Garth.